welcome back to the Firefly Studio 67. This is Gina. Um, I've got some more entries for the Friendship Journal Challenge and I want to just jump straight in guys. I've got several entries that have come through the mail so I may have to break this video up into two parts. Um, <clears throat> okay, entry number 13 is Jackie Chimes. Jackie is um, on YouTube here, I'm sure most of you know Jackie. Uh, she does beautiful work. <laughs> so I was thrilled um, that she was happy to participate in this challenge. And this is what Jackie has created. So thank you so much, Jackie. Okay, here's the front. Isn't that beautiful? Um, I believe those are some of my porch print papers. Don't hold me to that, but... Jackie loves the little fairies, and I am thrilled to see this because I like them as well. And the colors she's chosen are totally me. She's got the purples and then the greens, and look at that image on there. She's got lace, a uh, beautiful tab, which we all want so much, <laughs> that uh, Stampin' Up! tab uh, punch right there. Wow, that thing is, um, I don't know why they don't bring it back, but anyways, I'm, I'm off on a tangent again. <laughs> so she's backed this with um, different types of book page, it looks like, and then more lace down here. Stitching, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. Jackie does amazing work. Um, and then this is the back of the uh, tag. And again, look at that. Oh, that's my personal. Sorry. I'm just going to read this. Oh, thank you, Jackie. Really nice. Now look at that. That's a postcard with the fairies. She loves the fairies. <clears throat> and then she's got this beautiful lace along here and then stitch. That's just gorgeous. Well, it's not lace. It's, um, I don't know, it's thinner than a sari silk, but absolutely gorgeous. And it looks like she may have and I got <laughs> uh, flipping over here. This is gorgeous. Oh, Jackie, beautiful, absolutely beautiful. So that's got a magnet in there. Look at how she's layered that up. It's done the stitching, absolutely beautiful. I love the papers that you've chosen, Jackie. And then she's got another gorgeous tag in here. That is absolutely beautiful. I love that book page. And then here she's got two beautiful tags tucked in there. A lot of stitching, which I love. And look at that tag. Isn't that beautiful? I don't know what type of flower that is, but that's gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. And then over here, look at, she's got, um, that trim is just beautiful. Whatever it is that she's, oh, I'm going to have to try to find out. She's done some collaging here and then two more. Look at that. A tag. Oh, that's absolutely beautiful. Oh, Jackie, the colors are just beautiful in this. Really love that. And then look, look at that. She stitched around that. How clever is that? Eyelet and then more of that beautiful trim. Beautiful, Jackie. Absolutely beautiful. And then on the back, look at, she's done the, um, those paper clips. Everybody's doing, those are so pretty. And then look at this little booklet made out of a book page. Oh, I love that idea. Beautiful. That's a really, really sweet little notebook there. And then again, another one of the, um, the fairies, the flower fairies. Aren't they beautiful? And then some more of that beautiful lace. That's gorgeous, Jackie. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you so, so much. Um, I appreciate that. And sit that over. Again, I'm trying to stay organized, guys, as I put these away. So the next one is from Char Fisher. And again, uh, Char is here on <coughs> YouTube, so I will put her link in the um, description box. I want to show you how it came packaged. Absolutely beautiful. She's taken the um, pattern paper 
and look at the flower and then she had this twine wrapped around it. I just thought that was so pretty I had to show. <laughs> I love that. Such a beautiful package. And oh, Char, you have spoiled me. Oh, thank you so much, Char. You did not need to do this, but I certainly appreciate it. Look at this. She has done some hand-stamped trims. And I've got a story to tell you, Char. This is so ironic. This stamp, I had that stamp a few years back when we had our lighting company and I had spotted that and I purchased that and then I, I when I did a de-stash I got rid of it and I had not ever saved any of those images so this is it means more than you probably had realized um, so that is just wonderful because I like I said I didn't save anything that had that I was using it for the business but that's beautiful and look at this Absolutely, and I love how she, how you've done. Oh, just gorgeous! You guys are really, really um, creative in how you package things. <laughs> I need some work on that, <laughs> and I know I need work on that. <laughs> oh, absolutely gorgeous! Oh, I'll sit this over and have a look. That's a private note to me. should have done this sooner, but honestly, uh, I've been struggling to keep on top of everything, guys. Aww. That's beautiful, Char. Thank you. So the, I will tuck that into the pocket once the journal is complete, and I certainly appreciate the trim that you hand-stamped for me. That's really thoughtful of you. Oh! Ah! Uh even more goodies. Oh, wow. Beautiful. Oh, look at that. Oh, my goodness. She stitched all that together. Isn't that fabulous? Oh, I love that. Oh, Char, that, oh, that's amazing. Gosh. The ideas. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. Honestly, I just, I can't tell you how many ideas I have gotten from you, your, you know, all the entries. Thank you, Char, so much for that. And look at this beautiful fabric she's chosen here. Beautiful. Just beautiful. So that comes off. Oh, that, oh, yes, she had some. I f had forgot, she, I saw this on, she did a video for this, and I had forgotten she took the time to add this extra uh, bit of fabric in case I wanted to use that to stitch ends, which is wonderful. I'll see when, when the journal comes together how I do that, but that's really thoughtful of you to have done that. And look at the images she's done, and she's got the fussy cutting here. There's some cheesecloth back there. Let me see if I can show you guys. Look at all the die cuts. And then it looks like maybe like a sh uh, some sort of shimmer paste, maybe. Oh, she's done a lot of work on this. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at that snippet. That's beautiful. And a metal plate there. Oh, let's see here how this opens. Okay, wow. Look at this inside. This is fantastic. Oh, love that. Oh, thank you. She's got a little tea bag there, and then this little scrappy note that she's... Oh, that's beautiful. She's done stamping, and then that's a gorgeous page. Look at that. Look at all the stamping that she's done in that. Oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful, Char. And then she's got this beautiful journal card here. That's pretty. Really pretty stamping up there. And that's tucked in this beautiful lace pocket there. And then that flips over. And look, you've got a nice space. I could add a photo there. And then here, oh, oh this is so sweet. She's got a little fragrant um, sachet, and it's a fig and rose. Ooh, I cannot wait to smell that. 
Oh, that's so kind of you. Thank you, Char. Look at this collage, and I've got to bring this closer to the camera. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? She's got multiple layers there, and then that beautiful little um, vintage flower. And then that's a very old hanky, it looks like. And more on top of that. Oh, it's just beautiful. A lot of work. A lot of work went into that. And look at all of these beautiful tags. Oh, these are so pretty. Oh, that's a beautiful image. Oh, Char, this is just gorgeous. Thank you, thank you. Oh, and anything behind here? Oh, my goodness, look at that. Even there she's created this wonderful little pocket. And then inside this is this tiny little glassine. Oh, love it. Those are so sweet. I'm not seeing any little glassine um, envelopes that small, so that is really sweet. Gosh, can you imagine if all of our craft, all of us crafters around the world could get together and exchange the items that we can source? Oh, we'd, we'd be in heaven, wouldn't we? Because I see things in this, and she's from um, Australia, and I see things in here that I've not seen in the U.S. or the U.K., so that's amazing. Absolutely beautiful, and these images that she's chosen are so pretty. And again, more lace along the bottom there, and that flips over, and then I love how she has attached that. So over here, she's made another beautiful lace pocket, multiple layers of lace there, and another beautiful snippet. Let me show you up close again so you can see. Oh, it's just fabulous. And now this one, let's go in here before I flip it. Oh, I love that little journal card. Look at that. A lot of layering on that. And stamping. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So that's tucked in there. And then this flips over. Isn't that beautiful? Look at that little journal card. That is sweet. And more stamping on the back of that. That's tucked in there. And then this flips up. And look, at she's got a nice <coughs> large pocket here. This is just gorgeous. And again, another beautiful journal card with some stamping. That's a beautiful journal card. I love that die. That's really, really nice. It's a lot of places for me to write. So nice. Absolutely love it. Gosh, I, I think I'm going to have to plan on two journals um, to fit everything in, <laughs> which is so exciting. And look at the back of this. Now, this is a... <clears throat> That's beautiful. She's printed that on vellum and then come in and put this behind it. That is a gorgeous pocket. I love how that peeks through. Beautiful, Char. Absolutely gorgeous. Thank you so, so much. And the extras just <clears throat> will certainly be used. <laughs> okay, let's see where I am now. The next one is from Becky, and Becky is Studio Beck, and this is how Becky's came in. She had it beautifully wrapped, but because I opened it, um, I, you know, it's, I came out of the package, but she had a beautiful ro uh, bow around this. <clears throat> but she's included some extras, so thank you so much, Becky. That uh, wasn't necessary, but oh my gosh, I love this. Absolutely love this. I can never find these kind of things, but I'm going to have to get out more, I think. It's difficult to find anything when you're stuck in your studio all day, every day, isn't it? <laughs> and then here is a beautiful napkin with a bee and the butterfly. And, of course, my colors and little ladybug. Oh, thank you so much. Another beautiful napkin. <clears throat> Gosh, I appreciate it, guys, because I, I can certainly make use of those. And look at these. Now, this looks like maybe Arabic um, 
book pages. I've never ever had these. So that is absolutely amazing. Thank you for uh, for being so thoughtful and including those, uh, Becky. That is wonderful. Yeah, I have never ever seen uh, those kinds of pages. So here we go <clears throat> with Becky's entry. Bees, bees, I love it. Absolutely love it. And I love the colors in this. <clears throat> just gorgeous. Her stitching is just perfect. Absolutely perfect. And I don't know what kit she's used here, but it is fantastic. You know, I, I think uh, it's my life's goal to actually own every bee kit that is available. <laughs> I don't know if I'll achieve that, but look at that. She's done some stamping there, and I love the, the different... Uh, she's got sari and lace there. And then look at this one. It's a tag within a tag. Stitching is just beautiful. Look at that bee. Isn't that a gorgeous? And look, even back there she's layered that. Oh, God, that's a gorgeous kit. So pretty. Hmm, absolutely love it. And like I said, a little, um, like a faux stamp there with another bee on, and then another bit. A lot of layering on this uh, <clears throat> front page. Gorgeous. We open this up and look at that. Wow, this is beautiful. Beautiful lace here, pocket, and she stitched that so it's created two pockets. And look at those. So beautiful the way that um, shows through the pocket that way. And the image on the back, more bees. This is absolutely gorgeous. Now, this is um, a private note to me, so thank you so much for that, Becky. Uh, that was really thoughtful for you to include that. And another uh, postcard with a B on it. And look at that. It's lined on the back and then stamped. Just beautiful. Tuck that there. And then over here we've got um, a couple. Let me check the time, guys. Okay, we're okay. Uh, we've got a couple more tags here. A lot of stamping. Beautiful. And again... That's a real stamp. Oh, I love it. Look at that. That's a, a U.S. postage stamp. I love that. The wheels are turning. I might have to go to the post office next time I'm back and see if they've got any bee stamps. <laughs> Beautiful. And then look at that gorgeous little um, charm there with a bit of um, like a crocheted trim. Uh, light, you know, Bit of lace behind it is what I'm trying to say. And that flips over and look at that. A place for me to do some journaling on. Then over here more space for me to journal. Another beautiful. Oh she stenciled on this one. That's gorgeous. And then this, look at that. She stitched all the way around that um, little envelope pocket and inside Oh, take time to smell the roses. Love that. And such a sweet little library card. Ah, oh, beautiful. This is gorgeous. Love it. Again, I know I'm saying it so often. I'm sorry. I can't think of another word, though. And look at here. Look at that tag with the B. Isn't that beautiful? Stitching. More stamping behind there. And then a beautiful little notepad. And the coffee, is it coffee dye papers? Beautiful, beautiful shade. Oh, I love it. So yes, this is gorgeous. That kit is stunning. Thank you so much, Becky, for choosing <coughs> to participate in this. That is a beautiful entry, and I appreciate it so much. Excuse me, guys. I've got the croaky throat again today. Um, I'm going to stop here, guys, because I feel like I need to start. Um, and I will stop the camera and then come back. I've got a couple more entries to show you. 
Welcome back guys. Okay, we are on to entry number 16 and this comes all the way from Pennsylvania. And this is Linda Herlock. Linda, um, this is absolutely beautiful. Look at the colors on that and that um, trim is absolutely gorgeous that she's chosen there. Beautiful layering. The colors are, are just stunning. So let's look on the front here and see what we've got. We've got a beautiful little um, notebook. Oh, that's gorgeous how she's done that. Beautiful. Look at that. Stamping in there. That's all been coffee dyed. Oh, it's beautiful. Beautiful touches to that. So let me just put these back where, as I'm doing it, guys, it'll take a little bit longer, but I, I'd want to make sure everything goes back the way it came. <clears throat> in the back here. Yeah, so, oh, wow, look at that pocket. See, with everything out, isn't that fabulous? all that trim, book pages. These papers are just beautiful. Look at that. Fussy cut there. Oh, love it. Linda, this is gorgeous. So that's tucked in the back. I love that pocket there. Look at that stenciling. The crackle. I've got that stencil. I never have used it, I don't think, that crackling. You buy these things and you forget, but look at that. She stamped that definition. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Uh, sorry. I mean, seam binding. And that looks like maybe she's hand dyed that. I'm not too sure. So those are tucked in there. And then this little notebook, I believe, was in the front there. Oh, Linda, it's gorgeous. Amps. Oh, look at this. Layering with doily, some more trim. That is gorgeous. Beautiful little bee charm. Let me show you guys that. You've got to have a close-up of that. Isn't that beautiful? I love it. Oh, I'm just, I'm just blown away, honestly. Look at that. Stenciling behind that. Beautiful journal card. Oh, these are gorgeous. And then look at this. i got to see if that... Oh my goodness, does that open up? Oh, look at that. Oh my gosh, that is so clever. Oh, Linda, I'm going to have to pinch that idea if I can, if, if I might. Please let me know, because that is absolutely adorable. Look at that. She even stitched it. She even sewed that signature in. That is so sweet. I've never seen such a cute little um, notepad. <laughs> and so tiny. Gosh. See, this is the thing I struggle with, with the tiny things, is, is you know getting in and working with it. So I admire you for being able to do that. I will tie that back in a minute because it's going to take me a while. I've got big fingers. Beautiful. That is just such a sweet, sweet idea with that little tag. Oh, guys, I can't. I, I just now want to get my stuff back out. I just cleaned my studio to do this, and now I want to get all my stuff back out and uh, start playing. Oh, and Linda was so kind to send me a photo of um, the view from her place. And look at it, she's nearly buried up in snow. So thank you for that bit of snow this winter, uh, Linda, because you know I love it. I, I just think that's a really nice touch. And then she's also included a really nice le handwritten letter to me, and her uh, handwriting is gorgeous. So thank you, Linda, for taking the time to do that, because that means a lot. I, that's really, really kind of you. Here she's done a beautiful fabric uh, ruffle with a tiny little um, butterfly there. And then over here, look at all these beautiful little little envelopes that she's layered up and she's 
tucked all these bits of ephemera in. Ah, oh, it's just precious and beautiful. The way that looks on a page is just gorgeous. Really like this. Look at that. Look at those charms she's added there. Another, uh, looks like a notebook. Beautiful layering there. That paper is gorgeous. Oh, look at this. So we've got another journal card in here. And then, again, she's added all these beautiful little bits of, <coughs> excuse me, eph uh, ephemera. And then here, I don't want to tear that. Let me just get something here real quick, guys. I'm sure it's very sturdy. I'm just, my fingers, sometimes I struggle to get things. Look at that. That is beautiful. And then another tiny, tiny envelope on top of that. I love the layering. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. So again, she's come through the beautiful notebook. And then she's um, stamped throughout that. It's lovely. Really, really is. More layering there. And that's the back. And look at that. She's even reinforced that. So that is just gorgeous. Oh, I'm so excited, guys. I um, I can't wait to start building um, the journal and getting everything together. This is so exciting to me. And look at this. Isn't that a, the cutest paper clip ever? Look at that. She stitched that and bundled that up into a bow. And then she's altered, you know, the paper clip is up in there. Oh, she's got some great ideas. I love that. Just beautiful. Oh, so pretty. So that must have held this. Beautiful. Look at that. Linda, this is just fabulous. What a gorgeous notepad. And that must have been held in place there. Oh, it's fabulous, Linda. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, let me put that one away. And then I've got two more things to share with you guys. The next entry is all the way from Wisconsin. And this is from Sharon Horth. I hope I pronounced that right. And Sharon had this package so beautifully. But I took the bow off and so I'm sorry. Um, but that's how that was wrapped around here. And that is just beautiful tissue paper. So I'm certainly going to make use of that. <laughs> Look at that just beautiful and she's given me several sheets of that so thank you so much Sharon that was really thoughtful so she's given me a, a beautiful handwritten um, note and I appreciate that because I like to know about um, each of you and look at this uh, I was just blown away when I opened this entry up she has done all of this uh, beadwork <laughs> phenomenal. And the colors, again, the greens and the purples, just amazing. I wish you guys could feel it. I, it feels like handmade paper and then doilies layered, a postage stamp, and then this amazing creation. Oh, I couldn't even imagine sitting down. Let me show you guys a close-up of that. Look at that. The embroidery work. Isn't it beautiful? Just so pretty. And then inside, look at these colors. I love it. Absolutely love this. And look, oh, she's even put a uh, wax seal with the bumblebee. Fantastic. <laughs> and then another lace um, tuck spot there. And look at this. That opens up so I can do some writing there. Beautiful. Gosh, I, the, her papers are just, they 
feel amazing. And then again, beautiful button. And this is some velvet. She's and this this was wrapped up with that beautiful velvet. I don't have any of that um, Sharon, so that is much appreciated. I can give a little play around with, with uh, working with velvet. So this is tucked in here. These images are gorgeous. And then look at this. This is amazing. This is an altered, uh, like a double window envelope. And you know how I love my envelopes. So I'm thinking, where the heck did she find a double window? That's like, whoa. <laughs> it's like a double rainbow. <laughs> so I love that. Absolutely love it. And look at all the layering she did. Those are beautiful. It's like embroidery um, digitals. And then she's got this texture going on there. Another beautiful little, um, uh, what am I trying to say, a little, you know, cut out there. More trim. And I love that. It's got the letter G, which is amazing. A G brad. That is gorgeous. And then this is some beautiful twine. And inside, well, it carries on. Look at that. She's lined that. More layering. Another um, wax seal, which is just beautiful. I love this envelope. I just can't tell you um, I'm crazy about that. So beautiful. And then inside, look at this. She's tucked these in. That is like handmade paper. And then she's layered that image over it. She's sewn around that, stamped it. Just beautiful. Look at that. So much work. I just can't tell all of you. I, I'm just floored. Every entry has had so much thought and work put into it. I'm just, well, I'm just amazed. <laughs> I love it. It's just so, so special to have these things. And then look at, she's even done some stamping back there. It's just beautiful. Tuck that back in. That image is gorgeous. And then on the back here, look at this. <clears throat> and let me show you. Let me make sure there's nothing on there. No. Everything's good. The Journal City Shop. So you guys check her out. I'm going to put that in the link below. And then, again, <clears throat> she she wrote me a beautiful, beautiful letter on the back of this. And it is just so, so thoughtful. So thank you, uh, Sharon. That is much appreciated. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. I'm so sorry about my voice today. I've had a lot of that uh, Fabri-Tac glue going on this week, and uh, I think it's starting to affect my <clears throat> throat. Okay, so thank you all. Those are the five entries for the challenge, but I also have a, um, a bit of happy mail I wanted to share with you all, and this is from the amazing Debbie Hicks. Debbie... Um, purchased this from, <clears throat> let me get it right, I don't want to say wrong here, this is from Boho Daydreams, Debbie purchased this bundle especially for me, and I was so surprised when the mailman delivered this to me, so I want to thank you um, again, I, I've, I had contacted Debbie and told her how much I appreciated it, but I want I wanted to say that again because this is just an amazing um, bundle of trims and laces here. And of course, um, I don't often find you know with the boho because you know I like the pastels. But, oh my gosh, look at that piece! But this was amazing because this is definitely colors I can work with. And look at that; that's gorgeous. So yes, thank you, um, Debbie. This is just so, so thoughtful of you to have done it. And thank you, um, Sheila, for um, taking the time to send this because I know it's, it's a bit of a pain to send outside of the country. So um, I want to thank you as well, Sheila, for taking, you know, 
for, for doing that. It's really, really kind of you. <clears throat> Look at these. So, I think you guys can see what's in my future. <laughs> I'm going to definitely have to start looking through and um, planning out planning out some boho style journals. How fun. I think I can I've got some fabric that's going to coordinate beautifully with this and look at them. I mean, I can't believe how much is in this bundle. Unreal. Oh, that's absolutely stunning. Look at that. Oh my gosh, that I'm so sorry guys. This one definitely has to stay with me. That's got to go in my journal because those those colors, whoa, beautiful. Oh, I mean, who am I kidding? I'm not going to want to part with any of these, am I? <laughs> Just beautiful. Gosh, I don't know where she gets all of her trims, but she has got an amazing look at that one. See, this is why I just get amazed at the work that goes into these um, <clears throat> trims. You know, I had, had purchased those saris. Gosh, it's been a while back now, and I couldn't believe the work that goes into this. It's just amazing. Beautiful. It just I can't believe how much is in this bundle. I mean, this has got so many gorgeous trims. So thank you, thank you both. Look at that. Oh, she's even got some fabric there. Just try to get through. So I am worried about the time again. <laughs> it's going to be a long video, but I wanted to get these out because with the weekend coming up, I probably won't get a chance to film. Look at that. That's a nice, big, beautiful piece. I love that. And green. You know I love the green. Oh, those are gorgeous. <clears throat> Thank you, Debbie. That was very, very thoughtful of you, and I appreciate it so much. Okay, guys, that's it. I'm going to... Get this video edited and get it up. And um, thank you all so, so much again for joining me. Everybody have a great weekend and I'll see you soon. Bye.